Here at the Spire Research Centre, our interest is in essentially making the world a better place. We see opportunities to significantly improve air quality, overall emissions, and even make transportation cheaper. The space that I work in is what we call transportation electrification. Essentially, how do we make everything from our, our personal vehicles all the way through semi-tractor trailer trucks? How do we make them electric? How do we do this in a way that's good for the consumer, good for fleet operators, and good for electric utility in a way that will reduce emissions, reduce cost, make life better for all of us? And then there's this question of how do you charge the vehicle? We like to create an environment where we no longer care how, where, and when we charge the vehicles. But if you get in your car and you drive, you simply expect it to work. And we believe there are solutions to make that happen. And the Aspire Research Center is looking at new techniques to allow us to charge the vehicles more frequently at lower power levels so that the user really doesn't even know about the charging. It simply happens when you pull up to work, when you go home, really making this a convenience. Aspire is tightly integrated in here with the state of Utah. Not only is the Aspire Research Center headquartered here in the state of Utah, we have partnerships that allow us to work with local communities, including multiple communities in and around Salt Lake City, as we envision what are the real impacts of air quality from transportation on those communities, and how are we going to create meaningful jobs. The impact here in Utah is going to be just tremendous. The involvement of Aspire with the state of Utah includes the state legislature who have been tremendously supportive and significant in the formation of Aspire, and then the governor's office has been just critical uh, to the formation of Aspire.